It's been a long time coming, but SNK's iconic Samurai Showdown is back, and quite possibly better than ever. Even after the maligned previous title in this series that all but killed the franchise and henceforth shall go unnamed, this new entry brings everything you love to the modern gaming landscape, while retaining its core gameplay and adding several new wrinkles to keep things fresh. Instead of going for uncanny valley photorealism that so many games strive for these days, the developers doubled down on a heavily exaggerated cel-shaded art style and character designs. It gives the whole experience a very vibrant, colorful, and distinct look, unlike anything else currently out there. From its presentation to its mechanics, it's obvious from the first time you touch it that this game is a product created by fans and for fans. But if you've yet to dip your toe in this pool, don't worry. There's a character for every type of player out there, and with enough experimenting, you are bound to find one that works for you. Out of the entire Samurai Showdown series, this one might actually be the friendliest towards beginners. While I don't consider myself a hardcore member of the fighting game community, and honestly I'm kind of a scrub, I was still able to pull off moves and devastating attacks almost immediately, although I consistently got wrecked online. I'll chalk that up mostly to the crappy internet speeds where I live, though. The story is standard for the genre. Various fighters seek fame and or fortune by traveling the lands to find the strongest opponents they can, while a sinister dark force accumulates power and emerges in the distance. The wheel is not being reinvented, but in a throwback like this, it doesn't need to be. Any asinine excuse to make these characters clash is acceptable. Thankfully, each character has their own beautifully illustrated prologue and ending to make the trek worth it. What has always set Samurai Showdown apart from the rest of the flock is its deliberate pacing. Matches can end in just a few moves, and the fastest way to get shut down is to employ an all-out offense. This series and this game will always reward patience over rushdowns. If you focus on defense and find moments of opportunity to strike, you will be victorious more often than not. That said, everyone's moves are huge and flashy, commonly filling the screen with awesome flourishes that will rock your retinas. Any given match is guaranteed to feature at least a few holy shit moments of unbridled hype with everything from split-second parries to epic reversals that can completely change the tide of battle. Comebacks are common more often than not, which means that even if you're down, there's always potential to turn the tables. As time goes on and more pro-tier players give this a spin, expect to see some truly glorious combat. More characters and stages are on the way as well, so there's some greatness to come. Personally, I'll never forget the first time I laid eyes on a Samurai Showdown cabinet. It was at an arcade called Aladdin's Castle. I was instantly in love with the characters and the world it created, and it's this love that I see reflected in the 2019 rendition. Is it perfect? No. Will it ever be? Probably not. Will it replace Tekken or Street Fighter in overall worldwide popularity? Not in a million years. But, if you are so inclined, there is so much goddamn fun to be had here that Samurai Showdown will, forgive the pun, cut out its own permanent place in your library, and for that, I can't recommend it enough. Feel free to like and subscribe, and in the comments, let me know if I should do videos on newer games like this, or stick to retro stuff. I want to hear from you. Thanks, and I'll see you next time.